A step forward for a casino coming to the New York City area as the New York Gaming Commission is now accepting proposals. A number of locations are on the table. New York Mets owner Steve Cohen is interested in building near City Field at Willits Point. Chickasaw Nation is proposing a $3 billion waterfront casino in Coney Island. SLS Green is bidding for a gaming facility at 1515 Broadway in Times Square. And MGM is looking to expand 100 acres of Empire City Raceway and slots to gaming tables and venue space. A statement from Empire City said a full-scale casino would bring an influx of 13,000 jobs and $1 billion in economic activity to the region. Yonkers Mayor Mike Spano says he'll do anything to help this happen. We have to negotiate a community benefits package with them. So there's a lot of work to do in a very short period of time, but, uh, but we know that at the end of the day, it's going to be fruitful for the, for the city, for the state, and for the region. Every player needs $1 million just to fill out the 70-page application and at least a half-billion-dollar commitment for a licensing agreement. Proposals will only be considered by the state if they're embraced by the Community Advisory Committee and have Municipal Zoning Board approval, which may take some work in Times Square, with the Broadway League saying anywhere but Times Square. We don't want to see uh, the challenges to the economics of Times Square, the theater, the restaurants, the hotels uh, that would be caused by the disruption of a casino in an already successful, highly functioning business district.